Yo guys, what's up? I'm Will Map. In this video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to connect your Xbox to your PC slash laptop. That way you guys can use it for gaming or even, you know, stream if you want to. You, yeah, you can use it to stream. Um, before we get started with this video, if this video is helpful in the end, be sure to click that subscribe button. Also, click the bell icon to get notified whenever I upload more videos such as this one. I do tutorials. I do fun stuff. I don't know. Whatever you guys really want to see. Um, you guys can also find me on Facebook Gaming or even Twitch. You guys can find those links in the description of this video. So let's go ahead and get started with this video. So we're going to go ahead and start with the most important part of this video. The most important part of this tutorial is in order for this to work, you're going to need to turn on your Xbox. All right, so now what you're going to want to do is you're going to go ahead and go to your settings. And once your settings opens up, you're going to go ahead and go down to device and connections. Click on remote futures and then click on enable remote futures. As you guys can see, it's checked now. If it's already checked, you guys are good to go. And that's where you can go ahead and get everything connected. All right, so once you got your Xbox turned on, guys, what you're going to go ahead and do is you're going to type in the search bar, Xbox, obviously. Click on the Xbox app, and all newer computers or Microsoft computers, I think they're all Microsoft, to be honest, should have this app. And if you do not, go ahead and skip to the end. I will show you guys how to download this app. It's very simple, actually. It really is. But if you guys already have it, go ahead and open the Xbox and um, you're going to need to sign into your uh, your same Xbox account that you're using on your Xbox onto here. And once you're signed in, you're going to go ahead and click on Councils. And once you click on Councils, you're going to go ahead and click on the Council that says Xbox Council on. And once you do that, you're going to get this loading screen right here. And after that, you're pretty much set. You're in the Xbox. This is how I was showing you guys how to go to your settings. You can play your games such as Call of Duty, Cold War, and all that fun stuff. And um, let me go ahead and show you guys how to download this app if you guys don't have it already. And it's very simple to do. Alright, so in order to get the Xbox app, you're going to go ahead and go to your Microsoft Store. And you're going to open it up and wait for it to load. And once it loads, you're going to want to go ahead and go to your search bar at the top and type in Xbox. Very simple. X-B-O-X. -X, Xbox. And you're going to go ahead and download the first one that pops up, which is called Xbox. Not Xbox Game Pass. Not Xbox Live Gold. Just Xbox. As you guys can see, we've been using it. It's already installed. You're going to click right here where it says installed and install it. If you don't have it installed already... And that way you can finally get your Xbox app. All you, Like I said, all you guys got to do is sign in. And once you're signed in, just remember, click on council, click on uh, councils, Xbox council on, and it will direct you straight to your um, Xbox. Anyways, guys, hopefully this video was useful. Hopefully this video was helpful. Like I said, if this video did help, you got to go ahead and hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon next to it to get notified whenever I upload more videos such as these. Um, I mainly do Minecraft videos, but I want to start doing more videos. Anyways, guys, like I said, Facebook Gaming and Twitch, you guys can find me on. Um, links are in the description of this video, and I will see you all later. Peace, my dogs.